In this video I'll be showing you how to insert text boxes or frames as they're called in OpenOffice. The only difference I've found between Microsoft Office text box and the OpenOffice frame is that they're named differently. So in order to get a text box you just go to insert and go down to frame. Click it and this appears. You can customize some of this stuff now or go on to it later. You can make your text box bigger by dragging it, move it around, and to enter text you have to click outside then click back inside. Enter your text and there you have it. Now I'm going to go and show you some of the options. You can get to these by double clicking or right clicking and go down to frame. You can anchor to different parts of the page. You can manually set the width and height. This is automatically set when you drag it bigger and smaller though. So keep that in mind if you're stressing over the little values. You can also type in positioning numbers. This is automatically done when you click and drag it around. In wrap there's a bunch of different options and basically these little pictures demonstrate what they do and I'll just go and show you each one does. None kind of self-explanatory, no wrap at all. Before means your text will always be before your frame. After it's the reverse and parallel goes all the way around your frame. Through kind of strange if you don't have a transparent background but your text doesn't move and you can move your frame around it's just it'll cover up what's ever underneath. If you want to see what's underneath, you can change the background to be transparent, and I'll show you how to do that. Finally, optimal. If you want your sentences to read a bit easier, I recommend this because it breaks your lines and doesn't break up your sentences. In all the other ones, you start reading your sentence here and you have to continue on the other side of your frame. If it's a big frame, that's kind of a pain. You can add hyperlinks and you can also add borders. Default is usually to have a border so you can go select none and it'll get rid of the border or you can have custom border like say you just want the bottom just click on them and remove them and to click on the one you want to customize you can go change the color click OK. Now I have a border on the bottom background to get a transparent background just go and click white and 100 percent transparency go back to wrap and through and now even though it's kind of a bit tough to read I'll go and highlight the text red here I have my red text in my text box and my other text behind you can also format columns and width and macro but I'm not really sure what that one does. This has just been a quick video on how to insert text boxes called frames in OpenOffice.